Hey guys, Forex Capital here. Let's take a look and see what Monero is doing today. So looking at the daily chart, <clears throat> excuse me, nothing has changed from the last video I made. I mean, we're still in this consolidation right here. Um, the one good thing that we have going on for us is we're holding above the 200 day moving average, which is good. Now you do have the 20 day moving average here, but if one takes precedency will be the 200 day moving average now from this swing right here it looks like we're encountering encountering a lot of resistance at the 61 percent retracement <clears throat> excuse me guys now the other good thing that we have going on is rsi now alts right now are looking very bullish i am kind of surprised that this has not rallied harder. I mean, I'm starting to get wondering why, what's going on? Everything else is, so why is Monero rallying hard, harder? So that's something to keep in mind. Oh, by the way, guys, if you guys like the video, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to pulverize the like button because that's the only way we're gonna reach out to 7 billion people and we're gonna help everyone out here. If you remember, we're a community, so it's all about helping each other out. And Price action is currently not telling me that we're going to drop lower. RSI checks out. So as long as we're holding above your 200-day moving average here, we should be fine. If we break below, <clears throat> then we're more likely going to go to the $53 mark. Now, if we, if we do something like this, that we broke... <coughs> excuse me, guys. I'm having some heartburn right now. That we broke lower and then buyers came in and bid up the price and then we're good uh, I'm gonna start getting bullish on this once we pass the 70 level once we do that then we're we're gonna start getting bullish let's just move this right here <coughs> this fib so if we do this swing high right here now Where the fibs are matching here with the 200 day moving average. So, as long as we're holding above here, we're good. And if we break lower, then we should be concerned because we could go all the way down, you know, to 23% retracement or so. It just depends. <clears throat> but as of right now, I would kind of sit and wait. I mean, if you're going to place a position, your stop loss should be right below the 200 day moving average. Uh, risk should check out right now but i think there's a lot of better pairs out there where you can make some money instead of uh on this one so just keep that in mind also we're trying to narrow down guys uh, how often we post the videos so leave down in the comments below how often do you guys want to see the videos um that way we can get an idea because we're posting every day on our private chat but in the youtube channel <clears throat> we're trying to find a sweet spot Thanks again, guys.